How's your ankle feeling? I'm, coach said you tweaked it in practice, and I guess you tweaked it against uh, Temple, Temple as well. Yeah, um, it, it's doing good. I had uh, the same uh, ankle. I had uh, sprained a little bit uh, early in the season, so um, I've just been treating it, um, doing everything I can to get back to close to 100%. At this point in the season, you're that's something that you're just going to have to play through and just keep going to treatment and just hope it's as good as it can be. Yeah, everybody at this point in the season is not 100%. So this is all about dealing with the pain and find out, find out ways to win. Um, getting back to uh, the way you guys were playing before the kind of the last six games, what what is going to go into all of that? Have you guys talked as a, you know, just players about what you guys have to do or is it your coach leading it? And, how, how have you guys handled that? Um, well, I say just about like three days ago, we didn't know if we were gonna, you know, have a basketball game this yeah. weekend or this week. So, I think just that um, in itself is like another opportunity for us to just go out there and uh, we felt like um, we underperformed in the tournament, and it's just another uh, chance to prove ourselves. So, I think um, just for us to get back to who we are, we just got to come out to play and just be happy to play with each other because. When we lose again, it's, it's really over this time. What are your thoughts on Indiana State and what you've seen on film? Um, they're a really good basketball team, uh, really good offensively. Um, they got a couple players that can really hurt us if we let them get going. But um, uh, I think if we come to play and um, get back to our, our defensive principles, that we can make it tough on them. Um, and we're going into their home environment in Indiana State, so that's uh, also going to be a factor. But. I think we can get the job done if we come to play. You entered the portal and came to SMU last year. What, what What is that experience like for college basketball players, especially in today's day and age and everything that, you know, around just college sports in general right now? Uh, it's crazy. It's, um, it's crazy to me how it, it opens uh, literally like the second the conference tournament's over too. It's still like while people are playing. Um, but it is a business. Uh, I think players and coaches both understand that now. Um, and players are just also making the best decision for themselves.